Hi guys, it is Lone Falcon here with a brand new series called Explained. This episode, we're gonna do Star Wars Battlefront. The game mode is going to be Hero Hunt. Hero Hunt is a game mode where, with 12 people, one person gets selected as the hero or villain, and then the other people hunt them down. The goal of Hero Hunt is to do as much damage to the hero as possible. The more damage you do, the higher a chance you have to become a hero or villain. Some tips and tricks you can use for being an infantry in this game mode. You need a quick damage setup. My setup I like to use is a scattergun, explosive shot, and a jump pack. But you can do whatever you want, but I suggest if you don't have a scattergun, I suggest you use a pulse rifle or a cycler rifle. Because those will do a lot of damage if you get a well placed shot on them. Now, you always want to keep moving. You never want to stop. Because if you stop, then the hero can easily pick on you. Now, to find the hero, you're going to look at your radar down in the corner. When it's red, that means he's in that direction. So you always want to look at your radar when you play this game mode. Always collect power-ups if you can find some. Because those will help a lot. Here's another tip. If you kill the hero, and then everybody's on one side of the map, immediately hightail it to the other side of the map, so you can catch them while they spawn. That's it for the tips of the infantry member, let's head over to the hero. When you become a hero, that happens when you do the most damage. For example, if you see the window on my left, you can see that I'm number one. So when I get selected, I'm going to choose the right hero for the right situation. Now you gotta know your hero's strong suits. So I'm gonna do a little example here. I get chosen. It depletes all my damage so I don't get chosen again. I become Darth Vader. A good tactic is to know your strong suits. And your power-ups. Darth Vader is not good long range. So you're gonna wanna take some cover behind a close range place. If you're in third person you can peek around corners and see where they're coming from. Now you want to use your power-ups, because those will help. Never let them get too close. This tree is perfect cover for being Darth Vader. Now if you're Boba Fett, you're going to want to be not too open, but open enough that you can fly around and escape damage. See how I use my power-ups to overwhelm the enemy? They're trying to overwhelm me right now. Always pay attention to those little white waves that go over you. See, I get killed, but if you follow my instructions, sooner or later you'll be number one. Thank you for watching, and please subscribe.